School has failed you. Instead of teaching you things that actually matter, like how to make money online or how to get jacked or how to get healthy, they've taught you useless theories like the Pythagorean theorem and and derivative equations. (laughs) Can I tell you something? Knowing how to do derivative equations will never put food on your table. It will never allow you to live the, the dream life that you want. It'll never give you the power and influence that you want for your future. But learning how to make money, learning how to start a business will. And have you, have you ever sat back and thought why they, they don't even teach the basics of entrepreneurship in school? Like money is the lifeblood of our entire world and they don't even teach us how to handle it. It's, it's insanity. And I'm pissed off. And I say frick all of that. I'm going to show you right now for free like how to make money 101. This is everything you need broken down to the level of a third grade level of understanding so that you can understand exactly how to make money. I've never seen a video like this on YouTube and I want to give it to you right now for free. And why should you listen to me, right? It's a valid question. Well, maybe you shouldn't, but I am making currently making over six figures a year online, running my own businesses, all while sitting here in this bathrobe. I work whenever I want. I can live wherever I want. And if you want that to be your future, I want to tell you it's possible, but you can't follow the traditional path because they're not going to get you there. So you have a choice to make. You can listen to me, someone who truly believes in you and has big dreams for your life, for your life. Or you can listen to all the haters, all of your teachers, whoever's telling you, oh, you can't do that. Get a safe job. Do they have your best intentions in their mind? Maybe they do, but you have to choose who you want to listen to. And so today I want to show you how to make money. Here's what we're going to cover. Okay. The three phases to freedom. Phase one, digital economics. You're going to learn the money-making secrets that aren't taught in public schools that are turning clueless teenagers into millionaires almost overnight. Phase two, the uncommon path. You're going to learn the harsh truth behind why 99% of the population is still broke and the three steps you have to take to avoid that fate. Then in phase three, you're going to learn the autopilot client system, how to land low effort, high paying clients for any business fast without sending thousands of embarrassing cold DMs. And you might be thinking, KJ, this is too good to be true. Like, why, why are you giving this away for free? What's the catch? Are you going to sell us a course? No. I'm not here to sell you a course at the end of this video, I promise. I don't even care if you subscribe. The only reason I'm making this video is because I was stuck in your shoes less than two years ago. And I needed somebody to help me, somebody to tell me how to actually make money because no one was doing it. My business degree is worthless. It's over there in the corner. It didn't make me a dollar. So that's why I'm making this video. And I'm not going to ask for any of your money. But what I am going to ask is that you focus more on this video than you focused on any class in your entire life because there will be more value in this video than all of those classes. That's the promise I'm making to you today. And if you take action on these things I'm going to show you, your life will never be the same. So without further ado, I want you to put this video full screen, grab a notepad, sit back and commit to watching this because it's going to change your life. So let's begin. Welcome to phase one. This is digital economics. Now, let's, let's just be honest with each other. The only reason you're here watching this video is not because you think I'm cool in my bathrobe. It's simply because you want to make money, period. That's it. But just like 99% of the people in the world, you probably can't answer this simple question about money. And I don't blame you because they didn't teach you this in school. They never tell anyone this. But when you know the answer to this question, it becomes a very simple formula to make money in any single market. So... You're probably wondering, what's the question? Well, it's simple. What is money? I want you to take a second and to think of how you would answer this question. You got an answer? Good. You see, your answer should look something like this. Money is the byproduct of the value you provide to the marketplace. Now, if that was not your answer or you're a little confused, do not worry because that's why I'm making this video. I'm going to break it down so stupid simple that even a third grader could make money with this stuff. So don't worry. All right, so let's simplify it. Money equals value. Now that you know that, I can give you the real sauce. You see, to make more fun, to make more money, provide more value to more people. That is it. And that's what exactly I'm going to show you how to do today is how to do this equation. 
Because if you can provide a ton of value to a ton of people, you will make a ton of money. There's no other option. That's how it works. So let's dive in. You see all these things that other YouTubers teach, like drop shipping, social media marketing agencies, selling an online course. These are all tactics for what? For providing value. That's why they make money. But I don't want to show you tactics. I want to show you the underlying principle that every single one of those business model uses. That way you can actually make money with any business. And just knowing this one principle shows you how big of a scam that school is. Like all those insanely complex anti-derivative variable log equations, useless. <laughs> uh, having to write a 15-page paper on a book from the 1920s about social politics, useless. Now, why do I say that? Why do I call them useless? Because if you're tr trying to make money, you have to provide value. And those things I just talked about do not provide value to 99.999% of people. So think about it. If you walked up to your neighbor right now and said, uh, hey, Bob, do you want to read this research paper on uh, To Kill a Mockingbird and read about the author's purpose behind writing it? He's going to be like, dude, Frick no, get out of my face. Like, I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to talk about this. It's so boring. But if you went over to him and said, hey, can I mow your, your grass for you? He'd be like, sure. <laughs> Mowing grass is more valuable than that stupid stuff they teach you in school. Literally, you can make more money by starting a, a grass cutting business than you could trying to use that knowledge. It's all about value. Now, I'm not saying for you to drop out. Please don't, don't hear that the wrong way. All I'm saying is that you have to start viewing everything you learn through the lens of value. So whenever you learn something, ask yourself, how will this help me to provide more value to more people? And if it doesn't, then don't spend much time on it. Learn something else because your brain has limited capacity. You need to only be learning things that are going to provide a lot of value to a lot of people. So if we shouldn't learn what the current education system is teaching us, what do we learn? Well, that brings us to phase two, the uncommon path. You see, now that you've seen behind the curtains and you understand how the world actually works and how the education system has failed us and how money works, you're now faced with two paths. So you're faced with a decision right here today, okay? Now, it's going to be a little weird, but if, you're, if you really want this to change your life, you need to do this, okay? I want you to close your eyes and listen as I tell you about these paths. The first path is the path of the masses, and here's how it goes, okay? Close your eyes and listen. You forget everything I just told you. You don't question the system. You don't ask why. You go to high school, you graduate. You go to college, you graduate. You use the piece of paper they gave you at graduation to get a decent job. You spend that money from your decent job on an okay house and an okay car, you work nine to five, Monday through Friday, for 40 years. You retire only to realize that you don't have enough money to retire. So you get another job and you work that job until you die. If that sounds okay to you, there's zero problem with that. None. Like there, if you want to live that life, that's, that's fine. Like you do you. I, I don't want to be an online guru here. I want to be straight up and always honest with you guys. If that sounds okay to you and you just want to be lazy, that's fine. Like, why do you think that 99% of people choose this path? It's because it's easier. It's way easier. Just play it safe, follow the crowd, follow the sheep, and ha have the easy life. I don't blame you if you take it. Like, we're in America. Even that life is not that bad. But if you were choosing that path, I want you to know this video is not for you. There's no point in you watching the rest of it. So thanks for being here. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I wish you luck. But if that picture I just painted in your head scared the absolute crap out of you like it did me, then you were in the right spot, okay? And let me show you the second path. <laughs> hope you're excited. The path of the value creator. So you realize that your bank account, your social status, and the whole world itself revolves around your ability to create value. So you stop playing video games. You stop wasting the precious time that God has given you on this earth. You start spending every second you have learning how to create value. You start learning the high value skills. It gets tough, but you keep fighting. Your friends think you're crazy for not getting a safe job, but you know something they don't. 
you keep learning and you keep providing more and more value. And for a while, nothing changes. But all of a sudden, everything does. Your income explodes. You become so skilled at providing value, you begin making money almost effortlessly. $2,000 a month, $10,000 a month, $50,000 a month. You can't believe it. And neither can your friends or family. You've made so much money so fast, they think you're doing something illegal. You didn't have the money, and more importantly, the high-value skills to start the business of your dreams and create, create the life you always wanted. You see, this is the path of the value creator. And honestly, the choice is yours. It's completely up to you. But I encourage you to decide which path you want to take now. Because the, the worst thing you can do is end up on the wrong path 10 years from now and be miserable like most everyone else does. So, if you are ready to commit 100% to the path of the value creator and create the future that you want, making a freak ton of money by providing value for people and changing their lives, then let's keep moving. So now you know, money equals value. You know that in order to make more money, you need to provide more value to more people. You've realized that there are two paths you can take, and you've now decided to take the path of the value creator. So that leaves you with one burning question, which is, all right, KJ, how do I provide value? And not only that, how do you provide tons of value to tons of people and make tons of money? Now, the easy answer would be for me to like prescribe you some business model. But I've talked about how the business models are just tactics. They're not principles. So instead of giving you a quick fix, I want to help you understand this. So let me ask you a question. What do you find valuable in your life? Is it your car? Is it Netflix? Is it your phone? Have you ever stopped to think about why? Why are those things valuable to you? I'll give you a hint. You need to go somewhere fast. You need to communicate with anyone at any time. You don't want to be bored. Do you see a pattern here? You see all those things I just said are problems. So needing to go somewhere fast fixes it by a car. You need to communicate with anyone at any time. Phone. You, you don't want to be bored. Netflix. All of these things you find valuable are solving your problems. So value is created by solving problems. And if you solve bigger problems, you create more value and make more money. But there's an important lesson I'm going to share with you that I had to learn the hard way. You see, when I first discovered these principles three years ago, I asked myself the next logical question, which is, which problems can I solve? Because if I solve the problem, I create value, I make money. You know how it goes by now. So I was really into the underground rap scene. And I decided to open a small studio to record local rappers. And yes, this is 100% a true story. <laughs> so uh, enjoy this one, guys. You see, most underground rappers have a huge problem. They don't have any good gear and they don't know how to mix their music well. So even when they create or write a good song, it sounds terrible because they don't know how to mix. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to solve this problem. So I spent hundreds of hours. I was just locked in my room, avoiding schoolwork, learning how to mix music, practicing mixing different vocals and all the beats, everything. And I reached out to every artist that I, I knew or could get in touch with. They came to record in my studio and were blown away. Some of them were even like tearing up because they never heard their voice sound that good on a track before. I had solved a, a massive problem for them, like one of the biggest problems in their life, in their opinion. And I made tons of money, right? Wrong. After a year and a half of doing that business, spending thousands of hours, spending a ton of money, I made a total of $650. And I sat back and thought to myself, where did I go wrong? How did I not make any money? I solved a problem that was big for them, and then it hit me, you know, I had made a colossal mistake, huge mistake that cost me so much time and money. And the, the mistake was underground rappers are broke. They don't have any money. It wouldn't matter if I solved the biggest problem in their entire life. They couldn't pay for it because they didn't have money. And so that's the, that's the day I learned the most valuable lesson is that you have to solve problems for people that have money. Think about somebody trying to start a business to help homeless people. 
they're not going to make much money because the homeless people don't have any, any. So you have to solve problems for people that have a lot of money. All right. So let's keep going. If you truly grasp these concepts, you'll make 10 to 50 X the financial progress of your friends in half the time. So here it is. Money equals value. You create value by solving problems. So if you solve big problems for people with a lot of money, you will make a lot of money. It's that simple. But how do you do that? How do you solve problems for people with a lot of money? The fastest, easiest, and most profitable way to provide a lot of value is by learning high value skills. And these are skills that I'm about to show you that create extreme value for people and for the most important type of people who have a ton of money, which is business owners. You see, here's how it works. You learn high value skills. You use those skills to solve problems for people with money, which is business owners. Then you get paid for the level of value you provided, not how much time you work. You see, I get paid over $1,000 some hours thanks to knowing high value skills because all my clients care about, they don't care how long I work. They don't care that I'm here eight hours. They don't care none of that. All they care about is results. Did I make them money? And so when you position yourself this way, you can make as much money as you want in as little time as possible because it doesn't matter about time. It matters about skills, the results you gave them. And so that's why you have to learn high value skills in order to get your clients results and you make a ton of money. All right. So KJ, what are they? What are the high value skills? Well, these are the ones that I focus on. I suggest you start with copywriting, marketing, advertising, sales, storytelling, and hiring slash leadership. So if you master one of these, you will never have to work a normal job again. But if you master all of them, you can pretty much print money. You can make as much money as you want. You'll make millions and it won't even be hard. You're saying, all right, KJ, but what if I don't enjoy those skills? Well, don't worry. I'm going to show you how to leverage those skills to make money doing things that you love. It's not hard. And you can do that by applying one of these skills to something you're already interested in. So let me break it down for you to make it super simple. So let's say you like to film and edit videos. Editing does not provide a ton of value on its own. So you're realistically going to make like a thousand to three thousand, maybe five thousand dollars a month if you're lucky. And that's if you're actually good at editing videos. But if you combine video production with the skill of advertising, you can now write, shoot, record, and edit ads for businesses that will make them potentially hundreds of thousands of dollars, sometimes millions from just one good ad. You see, I have a good friend who does this. He combined his video skills with advertising and he makes over 10,000 a month easily just by adding one high value skill. And if he added another high value skill, like hiring slash leadership to his, to his skill stack, he could hire other videographers and then scale and make even more money while doing less work. But let me simplify it even further for you. Okay. Let me give you a personal example. You see, I've been a graphic designer for the past like 12 years. Ever since I was in middle school, I love playing around with Photoshop, but it has never paid well ever. That is until last year. You see, I started learning advertising and copywriting. And I started applying the principles of advertising to YouTube thumbnails to help people click on the videos more. And so then I started reaching out to big YouTubers telling them I could get them more clicks, which was valuable to them. And they were making money from their YouTube videos. So now I get paid like thousands per month just to do 15 minutes of work a day. And sometimes even less just by designing thumbnails. But it's not the thumbnail. Like, like it's not the design that makes the money. It's because I know psychology. And I know how to get people to click. That's what makes the big money. But I've applied it to a skill that I already loved, which was graphic design. And now I make thousands per month with it. Super easy. You see, I'm valuable to them, not just because I can make it look cool, but because I get the action they want out of their viewers. All right. So hopefully you're starting to understand it now. So if you pair one of these high value skills with the interests you already have, you could double, triple, even quadruple 10 X your income. But how do you, how do you decide which skill to pair with your interest? Well, if you didn't grab a notepad earlier, I want you to pause the video 
and go get it now because we are about to get serious. Now, if, if you're all in on this, do not be lazy. Go get the freaking notepad and a pen and come back and let's, let's dive in. I want to work this through with you. So here's how we pick your high value skill. First, I want you to take inventory of the current skills that you have. What are the things that you're already good at? What are you naturally good at? What are the things you've been doing? Next, I want you to take inventory of your current interests. What are the things that you're interested in? This is the stuff that you can't shut up about. You're always talking to people about these things. Like, What are your interests? Then I want you to find people in your interest domain who are already making money. So if you're interested in football, find somebody who's making money in the football interest domain. Next, determine which high value skill would make that person even more money. So look at their business. It's going to take some, some, some time, but look at them. Think how, how are they making their money? When you find out how and kind of draw it out, think to yourself, what would make them even more? This might sound a little tough, but if you can't do this, you're not going to make a lot of money. Okay. I promise you. So you have to just be able to do this. You have to learn, look at their entire business, figure out how it works and think to yourself, How can I make them more money? And then, number five, you learn the skill that you need to make that happen and combine it with your interests. You know what? I'm going to make this super easy for you, okay? I'll give you an example of exactly what I'm doing right now in real time. Like This is my current business plan that's making me over 10K a month, okay? So I took inventory of my current skill, which was content creation, video editing, and graphic design. Then I took inventory of my current interest, which was YouTube, online business, and self-improvement. Then I found people in my interest domain who were already making money. So I looked at YouTubers who sell info products. Next, I decided, all right, how can I make them more money? And I thought, well, if they had better sales pages, better video scripts, better sales emails, they'd make way more money. Simple as that. So I thought, okay, how do I make those things? What skill do I need? And I was like, oh, copywriting. I need to learn how to write copy. I need to learn how to write words that persuade. Simple as that. I learned copywriting. I then presented that offer to different people. And guess what? I now make 10K a month. It it sounds simple because it is. But you guys just aren't willing to do the work that's necessary. But now you know. Now you know the whole process. You have no excuse. I started doing this less than two months ago. And I'm already making 10K a month. This research should not take you more than 45 minutes to do. If you spend any longer than 45 minutes on those questions, you're procrastinating, okay? But go ahead and go do it right now. It'll change your life. All right, so once you've selected a skill, now you need to learn the skill. I have videos teaching how to learn things very fast, and I will go over that in the future. But for now, I want you just to move on. Just pick your skill, you know, pick, go through all those questions, have that ready, And um, let's move on to phase three, okay? I want to show you guys how to make money. All right, phase three. So you know that money equals value. You know that value is created by solving problems. You know that you can solve big problems by learning high value skills. You now selected a high value skill to pair with your already existing interest. You found a person or business with a big problem that you can solve with your high value skill. But now the next question is, how do you get them to pay you? How do you land these clients? I'm going to show you my autopilot client system that I've used to land some of the biggest clients in my niche and make over 10K a month in less than two months. And this is all without sending embarrassing cold DMs to thousands of people. And the best part is you're going to level up your skill as you do the outreach. So let's dig in. So here's how, here's the normal way to get clients. Right, you come up with an outreach script, a cold email template or cold DM template, and then you spam it to hundreds, if not thousands, of people. Then you try to get those people to get on a Zoom call with you and you then sell them on your services. As you can probably tell, there's a bunch of problems with this method. Number one, you have to send thousands of needy DMs just to get a few replies. Number two, out of the small percentage of people that you actually get replies from, You have to then get them on a sales call and even smaller percentage actually end up taking you on your services. Also, these are, you could, you're getting high quality and low quality clients. So you could be signing terrible clients with this method. 
because there's no discretion added. Next, you waste massive amounts of time and energy, which could have been spent becoming good at your high value skill by leveling up at your skill. Like I said, once you get good, you won't have to worry about the money, guys. So your number one priority should be getting good fast. But here's how we're going to sign clients along the way. So there's a new system where you do not have to look like a needy loser sending DMing random people all day. All right. And I've used this exact method and my response rate is literally over 50%. And I've landed over like 30% of the people I reach out to and did all of this while leveling up fast at my skill. Here's how it works. Number one, you need to make a list of your dream clients. You define people in your interest group that have a ton of money. It would be a huge opportunity for you. Like there's opportunity for you to help them and improve their stuff. And it, or, and it would be a great connection. This person would be nice to have in your network. Also, you need to know without a shadow of a doubt that your high value skill can make them more money. You have to be able to make them money or else they're not going to pay you. That's just how it works. Quality over quantity. You want the highest quality clients only. Okay, you want to focus all your effort on them. That's why we're making this list of dream clients. This is going to allow you to work less and make way more. So just trust me here. Next, you need to make personalized sample work for them. Okay, so your biggest bottleneck right now is the fact that you suck. You're not good at a high value skill. So your biggest priority is going to be getting good. And by doing client outreach like this, by focusing on the highest quality clients and you're making personalized work for them, you're getting practice every single day and you're getting high value leads. This is, this is like way better than the old method guys. And also this is an exponential game. These people are receiving hundreds of cold DMS every single day. And if your work, if your if your messages have like twice the value of someone else, you have a 10 times more likelihood that they'll actually work with you. It's all exponents. So you need to be in those few messages that they get that actually has a ton of value and they'll actually respond to. Number three, you need to send them this work expecting nothing in return. What I mean by this is don't hit them with a normal outreach message and just spam your, your content on the end of it. What you need to do is say, look, hey, I'm practicing video editing. I edited these videos for you. Feel free to use them if you want. Do you see how non-needy that is? There's no sales going on there. You just need to send them your work expecting nothing in return. You say, hey, I made this for you. Let me know what you think or feel free to use it. This is going to do one very important thing. This is going to demolish the, their sales guard. See, everyone has a sales guard. We don't want to be sold to, right? We want to buy. Think about when you're walking through the mall and you're you know, spending money buying shoes, buying fake jewelry, whatever we used to do you know, in, in the malls. But then you get this guy walking up to you who's trying to sell you his mixtape for a dollar. You just spent $150 on shoes, but all of a sudden you don't even want to touch this guy's $1 mixtape. The reason is, is because your sales guard is up. You don't want to be sold to, you want to buy. So that's what we, we present these people with. Send them free work, don't ask anything about sales. Then when they respond, here's what you do. You offer to do more work for free. That's it. You need to be able to make them money for free, period. That's how you get your foot in the door. So whenever they like your stuff, be like, hey, do you need anything else I can work on? I'll do it for free. Boom. Then if you're good, they will want you to continue working for them, meaning they will pay you. So step five is to land them as a paying client or option B, they will have referrals. And then once you have a referral, that is one of the most powerful things you can have in sales because now someone they trust has recommended you to them and they're way more likely to buy your services. And you know that they need your services because they were referred to you. This is how it works. And quick tip on like sales, like talking to these people, you need to sell like a doctor. So you're not needy. You're not forcing them to take the pills. You're saying, hey, what are your problems? Where are your pain points? Where are you hurting? You sit back and listen to them. You write it down like, okay. And then you prescribe them what you have. You say, oh yeah, I can definitely help with that. You want me to show you? No, non-needy, okay? Those are the five steps. So I want to recap in the simplest way possible 
how we can wrap up all this stuff taught you and start making money in the next three weeks. Okay, here it is. One, money equals value. Two, you create value, you create money by solving problems. Three, to make a lot of money, solve big problems for people with a lot of money. Four, to solve problems for people with a lot of money, learn high value skills. Five, to make money doing what you love, pair a high value skill with an interest you already have. Then six, to get clients, give them as much free value as you possibly can so they have no choice but to sign you or refer you to someone else. So now, you have the information. You have the game plan. There's only one thing left to do. You need a community. A brotherhood of entrepreneurs who have left the path of mediocrity and have set out on the path of value creation. And I'm making this video because I... I need this community. I don't have people who are on the same journey as me. And it's, it's lonely. I want to be grinding out real life with you guys. So I'm going to make a free community. 100% free on Discord. And uh, yeah, it's not made yet, but I'm going to create it. So if you want to be in that, join my email list. And I'll let you guys know when it's out. But huge warning. This is only for people who are 1,000% bought into the path of value creation. Okay? We do not do mediocrity in this group chat. I will kick you out. So if you're not 100% invested in this, if you're still watching TikTok, wasting your time like a degenerate all day and just staying up to 2 a.m. drinking every night, then this is not for you. But if you were all in, this is your place. This is your home. And I want to find some friends. I want to grind out real life with you guys and us all start winning. So that being said, now is your time. You've been given everything you need. The rest is up to you. I wish you luck. I'll see you tomorrow.